Hello, this is whatever you want to play here, and welcome to part 19 of Let's Play Sonic 06. Last time we just met up with Amy and we got out the forest. Anyways, what we're supposed to do is talk to people around town to see where Lord Regis is, because Lord Regis is the only person who can give us a pass to go to the desert in order to go find Sonic. But since I already know where to find him, I'm going to take you to him. You can you can thank me later. No, I, that just that just makes me sound like a jackass. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, anyways, here's Lord Regis. So let's talk to His Highness. <laughs> oh no, Lord. Oh no, Mac Eggman's mix. Blah blah blah. They're trying to get into the city. Blah blah blah. Anyways, the whole point of Lord Regis's mission is well, stop Eggman's mech from breaking into the castle town. I don't understand why Eggman needs to like destroy the gate. Why does he just not use his A carrier like he did in Sonic's opening and just drop them down up in there? Soliana clearly has no sort of air forces or anti-air air missiles. They clearly have nothing to fight against Eggman with. They can clearly Eggman can clearly decimate them. Why does he just not use the A-Carrier? No, no, why in fact does he not use the A-Carrier's laser beam? In fact, when you really think about it, the A-Carrier does not have the same laser beam. Ah, crap, and I got disconnected from Xbox Live again. Okay, I'm getting sick and tired of you, Xbox. I'm getting sick and tired of you disconnecting. But anyways, <laughs> let's throw these guys, they're really annoying me. And whoever keeps throwing the missiles... Ah, no, no! Ooh, ooh, I grabbed the missiles. Anyways, there should be oh one more guy. <laughs> what? I don't un I don't understand how that works, but okay. Whatever. Um some new enemies, no? Okay, now here's the new enemy. Let's quickly get rid of most of these guys. They'll mostly shoot missiles at you. What you wanna really do is pick up their missiles and other debris and come on. <laughs> Give me all the missiles you can. Because I need them. I need them to bring about your destruction. Eh. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, I'm wanting destruction and awesomeness. You just gotta love being a psychic hedgehog, throwing enemies around and using them as literal playthings. Eh, no, give me your missiles. Ha ha ha. One more enemy, and that should do it. That, oh, what? Oh, never mind. Never mind. Hey. A win's a win, no matter how you look at it. No matter how you look at it. That's that's my motto, anyways. That's my motto. Well, anyways, let's see. <laughs> Thank you to Town of Day, blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's see what our score is. Ooh, I think we actually got a pretty awesome score. Oh, uh, what? It's an A. Oh, well, it's an A. That's cool. That's cool with me. Come on, game. Come on. Stop loading. Come on, game, hurry. Head for the desert. Yes, we, I will go head for the desert right now. That's that's my main objective. That's the entire point of this part of the Let's Play. To head for the friggin' desert. I know I'm saying that sort of in a pissed off voice, but um... Well, as I said in one of Sonic's parts, I don't remember exactly which part it was, but I don't like doing the desert at Silver. I don't like it. It's not fun. It's not cool. It's not exciting. It sucks. The reason it sucks so much is because, well, I'll talk about that when I get to Dusty Desert. Okay, Silver, seriously, run faster. You run as fast as, a load, as the load screen in this game loads up. Seriously, can you be any slower? Anyways. Let's head for Dusty Desert right now. Jump! Hmm, I sense Sonic's presence here. Call it my girlish intuition. What am I doing? As soon as I find Sonic, I'll help you find who you're looking for, Silver. This looks so beautiful. What? You mean this desert? Everything is so great here, isn't it? The sky is gorgeous and everyone's happy. Huh? 
Let's go. I'll help you find who you're looking for. Okay, here's the worst stage in the Sonic game ever. Usually I wouldn't say that about Dusty Desert, for, but for Silver, it is the worst. It is the suckiest, most worst place ever. And if only for two exact things. I will talk about them when I get to them. That's not going to be very long, because trust me, it's not going to take... Oh wait, wait, never mind. Anyways, let's trigger. pick up these items, trust me. Yeah, you really want to pick up these items right now, because as you see, there's enemies right there. So let's destroy them, pick up their ah, debris. Nah, nah, nah. I just love using... Huh, why can't I pick up these enemy parts and like use them to, like, I don't know, destroy other enemies? I, I don't I don't know. This game never exactly gives me an exact reason why I can't do that, but hey. Anyways, let's Ooh! Give me your bullets. Give me your bullets. Anyways, here's one of the bad things about this game. You see these balls? This little gimmick here is the reason why I hate Dusty Desert. Because guess what? You have to hit the balls into the hole. But everything but you cannot use your psychic moves against them, like you can't lift them up. No, you have to use your psychic pimp slap in order to um get the balls in the holes. And not only that, they have this timer. Every single time you hit the balls, um they they'll count down, and the more they count, and then when they hit zero, well, they explode. They explode. Yeah. Yeah. This puzzle wouldn't be so gruesome if only it was like a timer thing and you could use your action and you can like lift up the balls that's the only reason I hate this damn puzzle you can't lift up the balls because for some reason you're not allowed to I don't understand that silver is a psychic hedgehog a psychic hedgehog why can't he not just pick up the pick up the balls and throw them into the thing I don't know this is never stated oh what okay that was that was my fault. I did. I was not looking at my meter. I, I wasn't looking at it. So, okay. So I will not blame the game for that. Let's charge up our meter and let's fly over here. Pick up this base. And what you're supposed to do with the bases are hit the statues in order to make a platform. <sighs> ha! Take that. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, what we're gonna want to do next is go over here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Fly over here, fly over here, come on. Ooh, I didn't think I was gonna make that, but hey, I made it. Anyways, let's wait for our psychic meter. Well, not psychic meter, it's just our meter, but I like to call it a psychic meter, or charge up meter, or. Oh, what? I was not looking at him and he hit me. That's. That's so wrong. That's. Uh, anyways, there's the second worst part of the game Amy. Playing as Amy. You know, I wouldn't find playing as Amy so bad if only she played as, so as her Sonic Adventure counterpart. Or heck, her Sonic Hero counterpart. But, but um, no. That's the, too bad. Every single time she double jumps, her double jump sort of lags, and it doesn't feel like it's going anywhere. So it's like, it's a 50-50 chance you'll make it or not. Not only that, every single time she attacks an enemy, her hammer has no reach. Like, look. Yeah, see right there? She has a hammer she can expand, yet it has no reach? What? That doesn't make any sense. Why does her hammer have no reach? Not only that, she has this stupid invisibility move. Yes, Amy, for some reason, can turn invisible. No, no, Amy, stop it, stop it. Whoa, 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 that was close. Anyways, what we're gonna wanna do is run over here and made it. I didn't think we were gonna make it, cause her jump, her d jumping and double jumping sometimes. Uh, but anyways, let's turn invisible. In order to turn invisible, you just hold the X button. Enemies cannot see you, but hey, for some reason this guy is still attacking, even though he can't see where I am. But at the same time, her invisibility is a double-edged sword. While you cannot, while she, while enemies cannot see her, at the same time it's hard for you to see her too. You have to always look at her shadow, and it's like for me this is sort of bad because when you do the double jump move. Well, you don't know whether or not you're going to make it or not. This makes it even worse. But anyways, that's only if you want to do like like stealth, a stealthy approach. It's not like as if it's not like as if we're playing a game where it's like invisibility is necessary. So again, I don't really understand why we have to turn invisible. This is I don't know. It just really confuses me. 
It's like, why do I need to turn invisible? What's the point of this power? It's like, it's not like as if I ain't gonna go and fight the enemies. No, I'm going to go fight the enemies. Anyways, let's go over here. And let's hit him. No, Amy, no. I thought he was, I thought she wasn't gonna hit him, but anyways. What we need to do is go over there. So, I guess the easiest way is just to double jump over here. Go over here. So far, so, uh, no, 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 Amy, 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 stop it, stop it. Anyways, let's hit this. Ooh, just hit me. Oh, well, I don't care. Let's go over here. Hit this next switch. Again, so far, so good. Yes, Silver, thank her. Thank her, because you need to do that. Anyways, let's fly over here, charge up our meter. Now, here's a little secret I like to do with Silver. I always like to press A multiple times because you use less of your meter. But anyways, let's use the psychic symbol here to open up the door. Why does Silver need a psychic symbol to do that? I don't know. No, 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 no. Silver, Silver, no, let's... Dang it, Silver. Dang it, Silver. No, Silver. No. No. Um, I don't know what just happened. Why is everything breaking apart? I don't get it. Did I do something? Did I... I don't... I don't get it. <sighs> no! Silver! Silver! Stop it! Stop it! <sighs> silver, silver, silver. Anyways, let's wait until these enemies throw these ass up. Ha ha ha! You, you thought you were gonna hit me with that, but instead you got to hit yourselves. Anyways, this... No, the door's not opening. I, oh, wait. Wrong door! Wrong door. False advertising. Anyways. What we're gonna want to do is activate the psychic symbol here. And let's see, let's go over here. There's another psychic symbol, so let's hurry before the sand gets us no silver, silver. And let's pick up these enemies' bullets. No, no, I'm not act no! Game! I'm not using the psychic symbol. Why does the game not dif differentiate? No, game. For Forget you guys. Seriously, forget you guys. Anyways, what we're gonna want to do is pick up this wrecking ball here. Not wrecking ball, spike ball. Why did I say wrecking ball? I don't know. Anyways, let's go over here. Fly over here. Oh crap, 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 crap. Ooh, that was close. Waiting for our meter to charge up. And let's go over here. There should be another psychic symbol. Yep. I was correcto mundo. Oh crap, crap, crap. Anyways, let's see if we can do anything against these guys. Probably, if we play our cards right. Let's hit this guy, hit this guy, and... Eh, no! No, I want to use him as a wrecking ball. Or not a wrecking ball, actually a, um... A, medi a medieval mace of sorts. I forgot what you call them. But they're sort of like flails. That's, that's what I'm thinking of. I want to use it as a flail. That's, that's what I was thinking of. Anyways, let's pick up this enemy. <laughs> That done. What? That's done. What? I didn't destroy all the enemies. Ah, here's the bane of my existence. Yeah, I keep saying that, but what you're going to do is hit the ball all the way over to the other side. Yeah. Get used to this, okay? Seriously, get used to this. This is the worst part of the game. You don't... Come on, ball, where are you? There you are. Yeah, get used to this. You're gonna be on this part a long time. I don't know how long I'm gonna be on this part. No! No! What? Okay, 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 game. Okay, it'll probably be a while before I get the ball in the hole, so just wait on a moment, okay?
Okay, after trial and error and trial and error, I finally got that fucking ball in the hole. Let's get this just in case. No. Uh, anyways, here's the gold ring. As you can see, I made it in 13 minutes. This shouldn't take so goddamn long, but... I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry y'all had to hear me rage like that. But anyways, on the next part of Let's Play Sonic 06, we will fight Sonic. Okay, let's see what our score is. Subscribe, rate, and comment, and we gotta be. This is whatever you want to play here, and bye bye